I'm here with the champ. <laughs> now, champ, when you were out doing champion shit, like a champ, as a champ. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Helene here in Las Vegas being joined by everyone's favorite, the one and only. Not only are you the new light heavyweight champion, but TikTok sensation also, Mr. Jamal Hill and a great swimmer, right? Who's still ducking me. I mean, you were right up until the swimming and the ducking part. I haven't been ducking you. You've been off training. So who, who does it look like it's been ducking? I was ready to go. I was ready to go the day of the challenge. You were like, no, I need practice. Well, I offered you a head start too. He's got a head start. Five second head start. Now I can get a head start. If we go from duck into a five second head start, I can't wait. What, what race is this? What race are you guys running? Yeah. Just wait till we hit the pool. How long? One way? One lap? I'm a sprinter, so we're going to go one lap. Yeah, me too. Good and then. Five second head start. Whatever, you know, forget whatever she wants. What's on, what's on the line here? What are you guys betting? What's the uh, bet? And I'll still give you a head start if you'll take it. I know you're the UFC champion, but instead of five second head start, what if I give you three now since you're champ? Three seconds, five seconds, wait. No, I don't like that. Nope, I don't like that. Are we talk, wait, are we talking about in a pool or it's like open water? Which do you prefer? Pool? pool. Yeah, in a pool. No, and I'm serious too. I mean, I accepted the challenge. This is on camera. It'll happen this summer. Why didn't you accept the challenge the day that I offered the challenge? You've been practicing. I told you this isn't fair at this point, you know, so I myself feel like it's only fair that I get time to train as well. And uh, yeah, I'll be ready to hold. Are we doing like, we get like a belt or a medal if I win? Yeah, I'll make a medal. You make a medal? I mean, most likely I'll be the one wearing it. No offense, but. That's, uh, that's what they said. That's what they said the last time. Hey, coming soon this summer, Helen versus the champ Jamal Hill in 20 or 50 meter swim race. Is 50 meter okay? I'm going to get my measuring tape out and then we're going to we'll see. We'll see. I picked, I, I picked the distance. Okay. I'm, I'm the champ. I'm picking the distance. Okay. That's fair. I'll give you that. So this summer, so stay tuned for that. But meanwhile, congratulations, a crazy couple months, right? From possibly fighting Anthony Smith and then getting the call and then now, you know, showing the world what you're made of and you become champ and then now everyone's coming after you. Yes, yeah, it's, it's crazy how it all turned out, you know, but uh, I think part of it was, I mean, partially, I'm happy that it happened so quick. So that way it just wasn't like long and drawn out and things like that. And um yeah, I was just, I don't know, man. I was just happy to show, you know what I mean, show what I can do and then, I mean, show prove to myself and get my answer to my question about if I can be the best. And I am. But do you ever reflect on this journey? I mean, it's been less than six years ago since you made your pro MMA debut, September 2017. Then you go on Dana White's Contender Series 2019. Now 2023 just began. And look, you have the golds wrapped around your waist now. Yeah, it is crazy. Sometimes, you know, just, just looking at it or just sitting quietly and thinking about it, yeah. But it just makes me hungry for more goals. It makes me want to set new goals and new boundaries and push those, you know, and uh, go for those. So, now nah, I just want to – I just want to hunt. I just want to hunt greatness, and I want, I want the top dudes. I want just the top, the best of the best. And chasing that greatness and chasing those next goals now, uh, what are some in mind for yourself? Oh, uh, like names? Yeah, whether it's names or goals you hope to uh, achieve. You know, right now, it's just just defenses. Uh, all the top guys that everybody that's like uh, right now, I just want to wash out the division. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I won't I won't smoke with everybody. I ain't ducking nobody. Anybody that rises to the top that make their way up there, I want it with you. I you know mean, that's a personal challenge to everybody, to everybody. You know, um, yeah, that's what I'm here for right now. I'm just I just want <laughs> I just want to take some heads off for real. I'm just hungry. I just want to take some heads off. Has anybody in the division impressed you, though, so far? 
I mean, yeah, I mean, um, I think the talent in division is is good, if not, I mean, better than it was before. And um, a lot of guys do a lot of different things. So you got a lot of different talents. You got a lot of different challenges. And uh, I'm just excited to just to see, you know what I mean, see how long I can weather the storm of them and, uh, and conquer those. And now you're also in the UFC for the video game, right? And I know you're a big gamer. Have you played as yourself yet, especially now as champ? Nope. No? Why not? It took too long to put me in the game. I'm petty. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm petty. And also, uh, there's some stat issues. The hand speed ain't right. Yeah, yeah t- right. tell them your defense thoughts. ain't right. You know, it's just, you know, you got to put a little bit more respect on the champ name. You know, if I'm before I hop on, just spend some time on those sticks with it. So when do you hope, ideally for you, to return? Uh, For me, I, I like to fight International Fight Week. I'll be... That'd be a, that'd be a good time slot for me and uh, give you know what I mean. But ideally, whenever if Yuri can be back by the summer and be ready around that time, that'd be perfect. I mean, that's the fight that I want. You know, whether whenever that is, but if not that, I'd like to fight International Fight Week. And when you do fight Yuri, how do you foresee it playing out? Uh, me winning dominantly. I plan on dominating everybody. I plan on dominating this division, just like I've been doing my career this entire time. So I just want to continue that. And lastly, it was just announced the Ultimate Fighter will be returning, and the coaches, Conor McGregor, will be fighting Michael Chandler. Who do you think wins that? The Ultimate Fighter? Or the... Yeah, when they do fight after the Ultimate, Ultimate Fighter. Fighter. The Ultimate Fighter. Um, I think if, if – um, hmm, that's a good one. Um, Conor's got good power and good precision, and he's good at being patient. Uh, Mike has that explosiveness. He has the power and uh, athleticism and wrestling and things like that. But I think a patient striker like that, if I think that's something that somewhere where Mike has to be smart and he has to be patient. I mean, a little bit more patient than he's been. So that's just pretty much just my take on the whole thing. And for all the fans who can't wait to watch for your return in the octagon and also when we race in the swim pool, what would you like to let them know? I'm coming. I'm coming. That's what she said.